my name is Sylvia Muramu Chabo. I am the founder of Andy Speaks for Special Needs Persons Africa. I founded Andy Speaks uh, as an inspiration by my own story as a parent of three children, two of them being special of special needs. One has autism and the other one has ADHD. This neurodevelopmental disabilities is something that not many people are aware of. And the journey opened my eyes in the lack of education facilities. Health uh, services are not as accessible as you would wish for any other neurotypical person, as we would like to say normal persons. And also just general acceptance and stigma from society with the effect of the way our children are stigmatized as they are growing up, which really affects their future and their self-esteem. After the founding of Andy Speaks, our core essence is to see how we can advocate for these special needs children because most of them do not talk. So we seek to be the voice for the special needs persons and see how we can intervene and bring in the government to adjust policies to have them included in the systems. And also the other thing that we do is offer training for parents so that we can subsidize the expenses that they go through as raising a special needs child is very expensive. Some of the challenges that we face through the journey is trying to access the authority and knowing who's the right person to deal with as we're trying to make um, conversations with the stakeholders so that change can be implemented and that we have inclusion. We've tried to partner with many organizations like the National Council and have conversations with them, the Ministry of Education, the Ministry of Health, and we're hoping that at one point we'll be able to talk to the government from the parliament and they look at our needs and what it is that our children go through. In the journey of raising my children, there was lack of information or access of the right people who we need to see so that our children can get the proper care that they deserve. This also advised the formation of uh, one project that we have called Special Needs Info Hub. This is a website where we are having uh, all the service provided and listed that are vetted. So we're also collaborating with the ministry so that we can have the proper contacts of the therapists, education uh, centers, early intervention centers, and therapy areas across the country so that if a parent is diagnosed, is given a diagnosis for their child, it does not become uh, another stress on addition to them. So they're able to just log in and find the information. If it's a school they're looking for, they can go there and find according to where they are based. So basically, we're bringing the information to your fingertips.